What is going on guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about what we got this week with the weekly update. Pretty small weekly update like we've had the last few weeks, but also uh, of course a new role, not really a new role, but a role expansion that is going to be coming out next week as well. Of course, before I get into it, if you're not subscribed, I would really appreciate it if you'd take time to click that subscribe button. Also check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate GT Racing. Like I said, there's going to be a new expansion next week. It's kind of what Rockstar is spinning his ass, but it's just a bounty hunter role expansion. They kind of started off by saying they're going to have a Red Dead Online standalone game available on December the 1st. This is going to be available across all platforms, so you can purchase this uh, for $4.99 until uh, February. Uh, this is going to run until February 15, 2021. So the 15th of February is when this price will kind of change over to the regular price. Uh, they said this $4.99 deal is a 75% off regular price deal. Uh, this is going to take up 123 gigs of disk space. So this is going to be for only, like I said, for only for Red Dead Online. If you want to play the story, you will have to purchase that separately. I think they're trying to get more people into playing Red Dead Online. So hopefully, or I think they're probably hoping that this will help by just being able to purchase it by itself. Of course, coming next week with this, you're going to have the Bounty Hunter role expansion. I think a lot of people were hoping for a new role. Um, this makes it kind of sound like to me they're going to start expanding all the roles eventually. But it says uh, they're going to have new uh, criminals to track down, prestigious level of, uh, level equipment and skills to unlock across 10 more bounty hunter ranks. There will also be new legendary bounties and a 100 rank outlaw pass coming with this. It says in addition uh, to this, this week all bounty hunter missions in Red Dead Online are rewarding double XP. Also this week, 30% off all coats and vests. 30% off saddles and improved saddles, 40% off outfits, including roll outfits, and of course the uh, double XP on land of opportunity missions and all bounty hunter missions as well. I'm going to link all this information down in the description if you'd like to read over some of it yourself. Uh, the thing, like I said, that was, I'm, I'm, it might be exciting for some, but it was kind of disappointing to me just adding 10 more ranks to uh, the bounty hunter itself. I'm not sure if this is going to be what everybody's really been wanting. I think people are wanting more content, not just a you know ten ranks added to the bounty hunter. Now, if they would have added ten ranks to all the roles, I, I could probably be a little bit more excited for it personally. But just ten more ranks to the bounty hunter, I'm not sure if they're going to start adding, like I said, ten ranks to all of them eventually. I'm sure they will since they're doing this with the bounty hunter. But I think a lot of people were hoping for more content, uh, maybe a brand new role, just a little bit something different. Considering new gen consoles are out now, um, I, I think people were hoping that they're going to be able to move forward with the game. Now, thinking maybe the older gen consoles were kind of what were holding it, uh, kind of holding it back. We kind of have to wait and see as you know the month uh, goes on and into December and see kind of what happens maybe into the beginning of next year. But of course, leave me a comment with your thoughts if you'd like to hit the like, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.